The National Sea Rescue Institute has launched a search after a 35-year-old man and his 10-year-old son went missing at uh, Beachview in Port Elizabeth last night. NSRI spokesperson Craig Lambinon says that the duo went missing after their fishing vessel capsized. Craig Lambinon is on the line now. Thanks very much for joining us on the program. Um, it, it's a day later now. How much do we know about the search and uh, what happened? At this stage of, good afternoon, this stage of police dive units, police canine search and rescue and coastal water rescue are continuing in an ongoing search operation uh, at uh, um, uh, the scene there. Um, there's still no sign of the uh, dad and his, and his uh, little boy, um, but that search will continue. Um, it appears that they had launched on a small canoe to go uh, fishing. Uh, it was very calm sea conditions. Um, despite that, it appears that they weren't wearing life jackets. They were about half a kilometre out to shore um, when uh, they reportedly capsized. The uh, teenage nephew was able to swim to shore, though it took him quite some time. Uh, he raised the alarm, and uh, the uh, small canoe and some of their fishing gear was found washed up on the uh, shoreline uh, during that search last night. Do we know what the uh, weather conditions were like? Uh, it was still daylight, wasn't it? Yeah, it was uh, 6 p.m. in the evening when they launched to go uh, fishing. Uh, sea conditions were calm. And uh, during the search, the calm sea conditions, as well as a full moon, aided in the search. Uh, but despite that, um, no sign of the uh, father and his son have been found. The 16-year-old boy, have you had an, a, a chance to talk to him and, uh, I suppose, give uh, some help in terms of location? Correct. Hmm. All right. But what did he say about the accident itself? Only that their boat capsized. He couldn't tell what, what made it capsize? Correct. All right. So uh, how long will this search continue? At this stage, it's an ongoing search operation, and there's been no um, indication of uh, when the search will um, uh, be completed. Um, I, I suppose that the longer it goes on, the, the, the greater the fear that uh, perhaps this is more trying to recover uh, uh, bodies rather than to save people. At this stage, we aren't speculating. All right, so Mr. Lambinon, we're going to leave it there, but thank you very much indeed uh, for the update. So that search continues uh, for that 35-year-old man and his son, uh, who's 10 years old, and uh, his 16-year-old uh, nephew managed to swim safely ashore. Uh, that's uh, just off the coast uh, in Port Elizabeth.